So, the form of the poem, the villanelle. Let's explain that, let's get that out of the way so we know what we're dealing with. The villanelle is a six stanza poem of three lines in each of the first five stanzas and four lines in the final stanza. Each line is in iambic pentameter. Nothing tricky there, you can just take a look at do not go gentle into that good night and see how that is obviously true. The tricky thing about the villanelle is that when you write one, you have to get the opening stanza right. You have to get it right because the first line of the poem will repeat as the final line of the second stanza. It will also repeat as the final line of the fourth stanza and the first line of the poem will repeat as the last but one line of the last stanza. The final line of the opening stanza will repeat as the final line of the third stanza, the final line of the fifth stanza and the final line of the poem proper. That's actually much more complicated to explain than it is to simply observe on the poem itself. So there's the poem. Now just note, opening line is the same as the closing line of the second stanza, closing line of the fourth stanza, and the last but one line of the poem. The closing line of the first stanza is the closing line of the third stanza, the closing line of the fifth stanza, and the closing line of the poem. What you have to say about this type of poetry writing is it's very, very economical. Because if you get your first stanza and you've got an opening line and a closing line that you really like, you can use them straight away. You just edit them in as their positions in the rest of the poem. Once you've written the opening stanza, you've already written one third of every other stanza in the poem and half of the final stanza. It's only got two rhymes in it as well. Once you've written the opening stanza, you know the words that all the other lines in the poem have to rhyme with. Do not go gentle into that good night. Old men should burn and rage at close of day. Every other line in the poem will rhyme with night and day. Okay, those are the limitations of the poem. And yet, if you have got an opening line that's really good, do not go gentle into that good night. And a, and a closing line, any line of poetry you write that's really good, don't you sometimes think that you could use that a bit more often in the poem? The reader is only going to read it once, and it's such a good line that you want to find a poetic form that would enable you to push that line into the reader's face a bit more, to make sure they heard it, appreciated it more. Rage, rage against the dying of the light would be one of those lines. Other examples of this particular form, Sylvia Plath has a beautiful one called Mad Girl's Love Song, where the opening stanza is, I shut my eyes and all the world drops dead. I lift my lids and all is born again. I think I made you up inside my head. That's the opening stanza for it. I did 36 of these in a book I once published. They are quite good to do, but this is possibly justifiably the most famous one. 